Alright people, welcome back to some more Vime and Y. So today is Monday, and that means that we are using Yubala Trains. Yes, so sadly Yubala Trains did get hit on the list. <laughs> to an extent, uh, the deck did run Triple Tour Guide because Triple you know, Tour Guide worked well with Eris, but you know, I'd rather have you know Tour Guide hit than be at 3 just for this deck, so I'm totally fine with that. So this deck will still be okay, you know. Eris was uh, still decent, you know, so most of the time she was just destroyed by battle, so I totally don't mind, you know, that card being hit. So I guess I'll go ahead and Foolish and send you Bell to begin with. And if he wants to go ahead and uh, MST this Oasis, then more power to you, sir. So, you have a fucking 51 card deck, no extra deck, like what, what are you using here, sir? What what are you using here today? You're like looking at my Yubel. You're like, what, ooh, what is that? Like, no, don't look at don't look Yubel. Ah, 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 ah! I knew you were gonna do that. That's why I did that play. Because I'm smart. That summon terror. There we go. Now I can take a more defensive route right now. See people, they just see, they just see it, and they just want to throw the MST at it. Like you, you don't even know. Of course, fucking D Fisher. Fucking fifty-one card deck number gender is like D Fisher. Like of course, of course, uh, fucking course. Well, this duel's gonna be fun, isn't it? This duel's gonna be super fun. Whenever I duel against a deck that uses D Fisher, they always get it. They always get it first turn. Always. It's just like, what the fuck? Always. Always, 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 always. If it's a DD deck, I'm gonna be like, yep. It's the only thing that's keeping this DD deck afloat. With D Fisher at one and Macro at one, but hey, the number fucking generator, so. So this duel is going to be fucking awesome. I wish I had a fucking art train. No, nope. just take the duel slow. If I had an art train, if I had an heiress in the graveyard, but now she will never get to the graveyard, so. Fucking d is just sitting there looming like, alright. Ultimate Nightmare, that's great. It's totally what I need to draw. Maybe one of these days you'll go ahead and give me exactly what I need. I've just been having a terrible time with you bell decks lately. Just today, just today I've been trying to freaking get some duels and some recordings and shit has not been going my way. It's during my end phase, but whatever. You know what? This duel's boring. <laughs> I'm sorry, that duel was boring. There's no way in fuck I was gonna be able to do anything with fucking defense. I was thinking about maybe trying to go into like a castell or something with terror fucking wiping my shit every single end phase. You know, and nothing be able to hit the grave. Like, I just couldn't do it. And I, I, there had been no way. I would pretty much have to wait for him to get rid of, uh. Wow, I really don't wanna do this, but I do. But I, I don't wanna do it, but I'm going to. Uh, what am I trying to say? I'd pretty much have to wait for him to get Terra off the field, which is, of course, being Terra being moved from place, and no more you bell for the rest of the duel, and uh, summon also Nightmare to even, you know, think about getting rid of that D Fisher. I'd have to summon something, summon something, Xe into Castell, detach, at least the monsters that I detach would go to the graveyard, I'd spin back the D Fisher, and hoping that he doesn't drive later. So, that's awesome. All right. Like I said, any deck, any DDD removal play deck, they always get first turn defense. Always. I never, I haven't seen it. Because they're, they're crap without it, you know? How are you supposed to use your DD survivors and your DD scouts without fucking defense? But, hey, you know? You get that fucking first turn fucking, uh, uh, defense and, you know, you're ready to go. So, number generator helps with that.
Once again, I opened them up fairly decently. Besides drawing off, I kept on drawing off a nightmare. I've been drawing off a nightmare all fucking day. Like literally, it's just also a nightmare, also a nightmare, also a nightmare, also a nightmare. Like, you know, I get it. It's a number generator, but like, can I not draw all a nightmare fucking twenty four seven? I just hit some back rows. Go ahead. What am I doing against back row deck? Ah, oh, you got back row. Everything is fine. When you, if you draw a whole bunch of back row, you're still chill because you can literally just one up your opponent. Yeah, so you got back row, so. Go to win the Wobble Chain, but there's really no point. There's no point in me like, overextending going into a Lavable Chain where he can easily hit it with back row when I can literally. Now, since I know I can poke him for, you know, this damage, I'm just gonna poke him with, for this damage. So, poke, 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 poke. You know, you can only take so many 19s to the chin. Yeah. Yeah. See? Mm. Yeah, like, like I said, at least you got back row. So now I know you got the MST. Oh, it's Evil Swarm. Wow, and you're gonna mash change second into Dark Wall. That's disgusting. That's fine though. We got Regeki. So evil swarms. Once again, D Fisher. Like what the fuck? I know the good majority of your cards right now. So the only one I don't know is this card right here. So I'll go ahead and so I'm gonna get tonight. Oh, okay. Okay, so now I know everything. I literally know everything in your top decking at this point. So that's awesome. Yeah, I'm just gonna go in Castell and fucking spin the. Should I go into Castell? Yeah, he's banished. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna overlay into Castell and spin back the fucking. Uh, D Fisher, so I can at least stay into this duel. So, Mr. Top Deck in. Let me see what you can draw. All in Armageddon Knights? Yeah, I guess so. I think I only run two in this deck, so. Understandable. Dark Ripper is more important. Ugh. So I'll just go ahead and. Normal summon. Yeah, I'm gonna take a little slow. Yeah, normal summon. 
Okay, cost. Like fucking Geralt's my nightmare. Let's say, am I literally gonna beat fucking Evil Swarms just because he can't fucking uh, draw into anything? And Castell, take your monster. I would have held on to that, but I guess. No, 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 because you have been run out of life points. So, this is MST. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. So, two cards unknown. Top deck into another Karakion. Mandra. Yep, GG. I beat. Oh, wow. I beat fucking Evil Swarms because he couldn't draw anything. Oh, wow. Not even. I shouldn't have won that duel, but. I should have been completely crushed by evil swarms, but hey. Like I said, number gen is interesting, like is this earlier gonna be fucking defigured that day? I don't like heroes. Not right, fine, fine. But, but as soon as you fucking summon Dark Wall, I'm gonna fucking quit, so. The only reason why I didn't quit when you summoned Dark Wall is before is because I had Redeki. Hands booty. This hand would be totally fine if I didn't once again draw you bell. Hate drawing you bell first one. It's the worst. Never draw you bell first one. Uh I'll go ahead and drop Eris. Eris will get it her effect. And I guess I'll go ahead and add I don't even know who I want to add. Uh uh Yeah, I'll be you. You know, I would totally win. I'm gonna get a night drop you bell set to call the haunted and it's probably gonna go MST. Yep, I knew it. Ah this card is sent to graveyard because of a card effect of being destroyed at battle. I'm gonna go ahead and change. So it's being sent to the graveyard by the card effect of Call of the Haunted. So at this point I mean I really don't care. I'll get commander. Save. See, if I didn't draw you bell, I would have Terra on the field right now. See? See, because I know they're just going to throw the MST at me, so. But I drew you bell, of course. Fucking Rex, one of the classic plays. Great. Okay. Did I just back to some monster? Yeah. Act. Yeah. You can only summon fiend type monsters when I do this. You can only put some in any. You can't put them except for fiend time monsters. That's fine. Go ahead. So I thought it's like I was like, if I get rid of that fucking Shikinaga, he and he burned up a crap ton of resources for that. So as long as I don't see, I'll be okay. Which this deck doesn't really exceed. Uh, I don't really care who I send, to tell you the truth. You can still come back into this duel just by drawing, using my points as the resource, taking damage and, you know, building up his resources again. Like, he'll be fine. I'm gonna hold on to these guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna summon him. 
because he can be used. He could be used with Ubel. Seriously? Am I gonna win another duel because my opponent can't do shit? Activate if I can do something. At this point, I'm not sure how many Shadals you run, but you're in a dire situation. I could Exiton. Foolish is a straight up neg, so I'll go ahead and just play that. Foolish is just straight neg. So I'll just go ahead and drop off the Nightmare. Alright, so if I see I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, my opponent has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yep, I can exit on. <sighs> wow. Wow. Uh, doesn't... Doesn't... Back to... Extra? Alright. Just wanted to make sure. And they only go back... They go to the... <laughs> they go to the grave when they're used as a fusion in hand. But if he was on the field, then he would go back to the extra. Wow, so all he had was his counter trap. Oh, I forgot about fucking Shadal Fusion. Totally forgot about the Shadal Fusion. That's okay. The card's stupid. Like, you get to just straight up plus and go fucking just delicious ham just because, uh, cause, because your opponent has extra deck monster. Like, what the fuck? Like, like who created this card? Hedgehog and... There's Construct. <sighs> you know, I'm so glad that fucking Shadals are dead in fucking, uh, in fucking OCG. I wish they were dead here. I hate Shadals. <laughs> like nothing about Shadals. They're my second most hated deck in Yu-Gi-Oh. Why did you do that? Cool. Okay. <laughs> like really? I was like, I was like, you're gonna play another shit off you like you're gonna activate one shit off you per turn. I was like, I don't even know why you sent another fucking hedgehog, like 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 dude, like hedgehog is hedgehog only you can only get one hedgehog effect per turn, like Whatever, I've been fine. Well, you could have summoned him, banished, banished her, pop that, attack him for 15, set the Oasis, and then he would have been the same fucking predicament. He could have fucking Shadal fusioned again for fucking, because it seemed like he had maybe like another Earth monster or whatever, and I would have just activated Oasis, summoned him back again, and then wrecked. So yeah, I had that duel. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I apologize. Fuck this deck is getting slowly getting weaker and weaker. Like I need I need to fix it. I'm probably gonna take out the the commanders because they're not doing shit. Like I haven't done that combo at all. And you know what? Since Snuff Steel is banned, you know, let's go ahead and just troll people. Let's go ahead and try out uh what's it called? I forgot what the name of the card was. Fuck. The fucking one I take eight hundred during I forgot the name of the card. Nah, whatever. I'll remember it. Alright. Well, I'll see you guys tomorrow with uh Plug Lush's Bell. Alright people, thanks for watching. Thank you.